Hello everybody and welcome back to this game making tutorial. Uh, in the first part we just uh, made the setup for the game and in this part we gonna make some items and uh, also see if uh, we can make the player pick them up. So let's continue from uh, last episode. Um, here you can see we have this guy running around and nothing on the screen to pick up yet so let's uh, get some items going mm. we're gonna make a new uh, object called items we made uh, We made an um, sprite for this object in last episode, so if you haven't watched that one yet, uh, go and have a look. And we also need a setup object, so um, oh, let's continue with this uh, item uh, object uh, in the create event. We just need a um, uh, variable for the for holding which item uh, this is. So initially it can be zero. And in the step event, we need to make sure that the sprite is. Uh, the right sprite uh, or index of the item sprite so uh, sorry image index is set to the item and also we we want to uh, have a collision detection with the player so so if uh, the player collide with the object we just wanna for now uh, destroy the item so instance destroy That should be it. Mm, and now let's uh, spread some items on the on the in the room to pick up. So let's create a um, uh, setup object. Sorry, not script. Delete. But um, object, create object, we call it object setup. And in uh, the setup object, we want to do some coding in the create event. In here, we're going to use the Enium just to, to have a place to store uh, the information about uh, all your items in the game. So we use Enium for that. It's very handy to use Enium if you have no experience with uh, Enium. Maybe you learn from this video and. Uh, it's not it's not that hard but uh, very useful so I, I will explain to you just uh, the first item uh, let's call it none uh, if you remember the last video uh, we set uh, in the items sprite we set the first uh, frame to uh, a clean sprite or nothing in it 
uh, the second, or let's have a look at it, because I don't remember. First, first, non apple, bone, and heart. So uh, let's go and get an apple, a bone, and a heart. And also, and um, for convenience, we we add one extra here. So uh, just to uh, know the total uh, number of items uh, in this item list. Uh, Enium works as this. Uh, you give it a name. Uh, if I now do items, uh, Apple. Uh, this this only holds a number, and its uh, first one is zero, second is one. So this variable now is is one. That's it. Second one, bone, two, heart, three, and total is four. We have four items, uh, counting with the non-item. So, and uh, now let's try to to draw some items onto the screen. Um, let's uh, just make a four. Loop here to have some items. If I is less than, let's make 20 items. And in here, we gonna create items. So, um, Instance, instance create, not depth, but layer. And we're going to set the Y position and X and Y position. And let's just do that by a random number. Random, and we we can use the we can use the size of the screen, which is thirteen sixty six. But we don't want it all the way to the uh, edge of the screen. So let's take away 64 from that and I add uh, 32 that that will make us have a frame around uh, the room which uh, we don't have any spawn so that was X and let's do the same for the Y which is 768 Uh, and we want to subtract 64 and add 32 in the end. And uh, at what layer? Uh, do, <coughs> sorry. Do we want to place it on? We want to place it on the instances layer. And the object we want to place there is the object item like this uh, why didn't that one get red because i need an s in the end okay so um we haven't set the index or sprite index. What uh, what is the index of the sprite? So uh, we need to store uh, the item we are creating in a variable. So 
instance we just call it inst equals and uh, now we can do stuff to the item we just created uh, remember uh, the we had in here we had only one uh, variable which was the item so we want to set the uh, which item and we had uh, we could use the random or actually I should change up here too but to I random just to get the whole number instead of uh, uh number with the uh, comma um next oh. and uh, we had the first one was empty one we had three items so we set it to two and then we get from zero to two, but we don't want zero, so we add one. Okay. Uh, now we need to add the set of to the room, the object to the room. We can just place it up here. And now if we start it, hopefully, we get some items spread across the screen. Let's try. Yes. Are we? And we're also able to pick them up, or we're not picking them up yet, but uh, yeah. Actually, um, they are a bit big, but uh, it doesn't matter. Mm, or actually, let's resize uh, the items. Sprite. I want them to be 32. Oops, that didn't work very well. Let's do it again. Mm. We want to resize or rescale is it we want, not resize. That's better. Let's run it again. Like this, that looks a bit better. And now we can go pick up all items. So, but we don't have any inventory yet. So follow me on the next episode and uh, we will start adding an inventory. Thank you for watching uh, this uh, episode and I hope I see you in the next one.